Okay, I'm Edmund Edgar. I run Reality Keys. I'm going to keep this short to leave some room for um, Thomas, who's going to show you something crazy cool in the same vein using TL TLS Notary. Um, so we're an Oracle service. We've been running since um, early uh, 2014. We, we started off um, providing keys that you could use to make smart contracts with Bitcoin. Um, now, so, so we've been doing that for a while. Obviously, there were a lot of limitations making smart contracts with Bitcoin. Um, so now we've started publishing some data that you can use with Ethereum, um, which is going to have, as we all know, a lot more possibilities. Um, our process is very simple. We pull from an API, we publish what we see. Um, if that API was correct, you can just leave that as it is and we'll provide you that data for free. Um, if that information was incorrect, you can just send us a dispute fee and we'll check it out. Um, and what that allows us to do is um, to pull from some fairly um, unreliable data sources. So we can use data, for example, we use data in the past from Freebase uh, or from Wikidata, which are things that people can tamper with. But ultimately, if you pay a fee, we can check it out and we can get you to the right answer. Um, we found with Bitcoin, we found people coming up with all kinds of crazy data that they're interested in, that they want to make smart contracts about that we weren't expecting. We found that people wanted to make smart contracts with their future selves, say, if I do this run, I'm going to get my money back. If I fail to do the run, my money's going to charity. We found all kinds of things that people want to do. So if there's some data you need, you need it certified so that you can make a tr trusted contact, uh, contract based on it, and you don't see it on the site, then just let us know. Um, right now, what we're doing is we're doing the whole thing off-chain. So we sign data. We give you some data and a signature. You can make an Ethereum contract that just checks that signature and then uses the data. Um, it's not particularly hard for us if people need it to um, do it kind of the traditional Ethereum way, traditional way of, um, of just publishing a feed um, to the chain. We can do that as well. So just let us know. So that's realitykeys.com. Um, I know there are, there's, uh, you'll be hearing from Thomas next, who also runs a, um, an Oracle service. And I think there'll be another one coming fairly soon. So it shouldn't be long until there is something like at least um, three independent um, trusted sources of data um, in the market. So you can combine those. You can say, if you don't want to trust one of us, you'll be able to say um, two out of three of these have to give you know, this particular answer. Um, and there are also people talking. If you look at, for example, um, Martin from Consensus' piece on um, the ultimate oracle, there are also some ideas about um, putting a a proof of stake voting system above the Oracle um, system. So first of all, you get these answers from the Oracle. It's very quick and very cheap. But then if somebody doesn't trust the Oracle or if somebody thinks they're wrong, then you can throw it to, um, to a, a, a vote um, if you think that you've got a, a situation where um, you can get a more reliable um, result from sort of proof of stake voting system. So there are all kinds of things you can do with this. Um, if, if you don't see what you need, then uh, get in touch, and I hope you can have a play around with it and see what you can do with it. Okay, so that's realitykeys.com.